You recommended Slapped Ham. Drop a thumbs up and let's check it out. We got apparently no, real paranormal activity. Our first clip of the day has been going viral this past couple of weeks as it purports to show a haunted church. The video, which was shared to TikTok by user Did You See It, shows a pastor in his church making a quick video update for his congregation. As he does, uh -huh. things begin to get a little strange. Take a look. Pastor Aaron here. It's my pleasure just to announce that we this Sunday will be, oh, we'll be uh, <laughs> open. Oh, damn. Damn. Over and over, the podium behind the priest falls over. Falling over. You think it's legit or somebody wired it up? On its own, and it's, uh, it's stable. I mean, it's not wobbly at all. It's, uh, kind of like... The path. So this is for the second time it falls? then shows us that there's no air conditioning or breeze that could have made the podium move. No air conditioning. It's these things. They're off. Damn. No. Let me take a... So I'm just going to sit here and watch it for a little bit. Towards the end of the clip, a flag begins to move as well. Damn. Yo, yeah. I want him to go over there and, like, p move his hands over there and see if there's a wire attached or not. That hasn't been moving. Nothing Pastor else. catches. There's no breeze. It's moving again. Damn. Damn. <laughs> What the you fact think, that man? this footage was captured by a priest has led thousands of viewers to believe that this could be genuine paranormal activity. A lot of comments said that they'd like to think a man of the cloth wouldn't make a hoax video just for... <laughs> Yo, that's true though, like, if a pastor catches it, damn man, that's a bit of crazy. Fun. There were a few commenters who thought they could see a piece of string pulling the podium over. However, it's hard to confirm as nothing seems to stand out. Mm. Uh, it's stable. I mean, it's not wobbly at all. I definitely want him to go over there and just see if there's a wire or not. It's, uh, kind of like... Some viewers thought it was demonic energy antagonizing the priest in his own church. So what do you think? Bro, don't they have... Don't, don't ghosts have policies to not show up in, like, a religious area? You know what? You know what I mean? Like, especially in a church now. I, 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 I don't believe it, man. I don't believe it. Are we it. witnessing some real paranormal activity here? Or is this priest deceiving us? Let me know where I you think land on this in. in the comments below. Pastor Aaron here. It's my pleasure just to announce that we... This Sunday will be... Oh. We'll be uh, open. Yeah, I think... I don't know, man. Number five. Uh -oh. Some months ago, a family in an undisclosed part of Russia began experiencing some unusual activity around their home, in particular near their laundry area. They set up a camera to roll 24-7 to try and catch proof that something strange really was what? happening. The footage was shared to TikTok by user TikTok Paranormal. Take a look at what's been captured. What? Oh my god, let me just... Two rounds fired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. let me put in the bucket. Seems to move on its own. Damn! I don't see no wire attached, but I don't know, man. Separate that day, is... the same towel appears to be levitating in midair. El Chupacabra? Oh, hey, hey, what? Another what? day shows a tennis ball moving around the room. Yo, that is defying gravity, my guy. The homeowner then tries an experiment by placing some flour on the floor. Take a look at what happens. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, turns off the lights, closes door, pieces out. Is it gonna fly? I think it's gonna, the floor, what? Something seems to pass right through the flower. She tries okay, the that's... same thing with a mug. A good magician or you think this is legit? Because to do that with flour, I'm not sure. There has to be a trick with it. Or y'all think it's legit. Damn. Damn. Things then seem to escalate. Yo, the entire door. You're not the door, man. That cost a lot of the money, man. The door comes off its hinges. It's almost as though somebody's like taking the door like that and just like pushing it and then just, you know what I mean? 
then more eerie activity is captured by the camera. Oh, the books? Bro, I don't know, man. Either a really real good magician or this legit. Looking more closely, the pages in the book appear to fold by themselves. By themselves? Damn. Even the peach? Oh and my here, god! Yet more movement can be. Bro, like you see this, Shiza? You see this? And here, yeah. The page like falls and then closes. More Damn. movement can be seen. Oh my god! It's it's not scary, but but it's like bizarre. You know what I mean? So what's happening in this home in Russia? A lot of viewers were genuinely terrified for this poor woman's safety, with some saying she should leave the house immediately or yeah. get a priest to come bless the space. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, there's very little information for us to run with with this series of clips. We don't. Yo, any, any, any Russian homie out there, uh, can a brother please get the translation of what she uh, she put uh, here on the on the video? Know where exactly it was filmed or by who? So for now, unless more info comes to hand, this bizarre series of clips will have to remain Damn. in history. In Soviet Russia, you do not drop the books. The books drop themselves, dude. Actually a reality. Actually. Oh, this next oh, one was snap. sent to us by a viewer named April C from the Philippines. April says she was on a Zoom call running a training session with some colleagues when they eventually got to chatting about paranormal experiences. AJ in the bottom left said that he believes his apartment is haunted. He says he's seen the ghostly uh -oh. forms of a woman and a young child walking through his home. He's also seen doors. I mean, you're not gonna be able to sleep tonight by the looks on their boys. own, taps turn on, and weird noises can be heard at all hours of the night. Anyone that sleeps over in the apartment has a dream that a small child is sitting on their chest. They become hard of breath and wake up in a fit of pain. Yo, what's more scary, seeing like a like a like a full blown adult ghost or a child ghost? What's more scary to you? Panic to an empty room. AJ just laughed it off and they continued their training. Because they work for an international client, the footage you're about to see was captured at exactly 3 a.m. That's when Damn. something odd was caught on AJ's webcam. 3 a.m. So guys, it's already 12 p.m. You may join Vince sa Google Meet na link sa calendar invite and no, I'm so tired. What? She seems to be scared. Yo, what the is going on right now? I do not so know guys, why. It's already 12 p.m. You may join oh Vince sa Google Meet na link sa calendar invite and Oh, that's when Stooped she got scared. Down, AJ shows the group that he's alone, but doesn't quite know what the rest of the group saw. Ako yung nakita sa likod ni mo. Ano yan lang? Oh, eh, 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 dito, dito, wow! Sa pikas, sa pikas, sa pikas. Masa? Da, how much bus? Oh man, wait, wait, wait. If we watch it again, slowed down, you can see a pale form pass by in the background. Yeah. Or oh, what? April's a big fan. I don't know about that. What if it's like a cloth? It seems like a cloth, right? It certainly feels like a cloth, and I do see the AC there. So what if the AC kind of pushed it by? Yeah, I don't know, man. If it if it, if it was the AC pushing it, like the air pushing it, why didn't it push it before or after? Ooh, that's a, that's an interesting question. Dasha? And of our show, and didn't think anything paranormal would happen to her. To this day, she still can't explain the strange shape in AJ's feed. Given that he believes his apartment is haunted, it certainly does make you wonder what this thing could be. So guys, it's already 12 p.m. You may join Vince. Are they reaching or no reaching? Sa Google what you think? Sa calendar invite and... Okay, did it, did it happen like two, three times or did he rewind the video? That's odd. Certainly Last odd. Year, we ran a story on a man named Mario Lara. He runs a party supply shop in Guadalajara in the western state of Jalisco, Mexico. Mario believes his store is haunted by an unknown presence. For some Number time three. now, he's been uploading downright chilling footage from inside his store. Bruh. His store is reportedly so haunted it's become somewhat of an attraction in the local area. 
All kinds of alleged paranormal events have taken place, like objects moving on their own, eerie figures have been caught on camera, and staff members have even been oh, aggressively yeah. attacked. Bro, oh. we've seen this video! Yo, 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 I remember, I, I, I was reacting to Bizarre Bob, and, and he had that clip. I, I did react to one of the episodes, so if you're brand new, you gotta, you gotta binge the videos, man. I'm telling you, this, this is a content right there, dog. Unseen forces. Damn. Last time, we showed one of his most famous pieces of evidence. Take a look. Uh-oh. 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 What? What? Eh, eh. Yeah, this right here. This, this, this. Oh, eh, eh. Damn. That thing is still there? Oh. What? What the? What the hell? What the hell? Yo, that thing is moving, goddamn. Bro, is that like a shadow figure or that like mannequin statue or something? Is this supposed to be like like a mannequin moving? I, because to me, it's, it's looking like it's a shadow. Oh, oh, it's a shadow. Oh my god. He tried an experiment with some flour on the floor. Take a look at what happens. What the hell? Okay, something's falling. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I feel like something's just gonna jump off or something. Oh, the. F oh my god. Well, now another startling piece of footage has been captured. Okay, listen. That's very compelling. Very compelling. The only way I think that could be faked out is if somebody was just uh, having like a green screen. If they were wearing green screen, because yep, there are clothes that are fully uh, green color. You can wear them. Twitch streamers have been doing that for a long, long time. And then you can go invisible with the help of green screen. So it's either that or... I mean, it's compelling for Inside sure. Mario very compelling. Store. This was captured in the middle of the day while Mario was standing in the showroom. Take a look. I'm assuming something will happen behind it? Or the... Oh! Eh, eh, eh. Whoa! What? Oh my god! What the... What? So, is that a cat? Oh my god! Bro, his fi... His finger, damn! Watching that again closely, you can see one of Mario's fingers twist back violently. He looks to be in great pain as he tries to straighten his finger. Yo, I'm shocked, dude. Damn. Now, listen. This... How would you say this could be fake, right? Did he, like, actually hurt himself? Did he, like, attach, like, a wire to his um, fingers and made someone like mo pull it and he would he knows then he would break his fingers you know what i mean like would he really would someone really go that far some would some people actually would but nah man yeah i i i, I don't think this being i don't see this being fake though so what's going on here the more evidence that piles up, the more people are starting to believe that Mario's store could genuinely be haunted by some kind of malicious spirit. Yeah, the cat just pieces out too. The cats don't give a damn, dog. <laughs> they, they ain't loyal, man. They ain't loyal. I love the cats. I'm a cat's person more than dog. Oh, hey. This oh, next oh. clip comes from one of our viewers, Amye Price. They posted the video to our Facebook community page asking other members for their opinions. Contact says from beyond. She was recently sitting in her living room when suddenly a balloon floated strangely out of her daughter's room. Take a look. Yo, can a brother perhaps get a needle? I wanna I wanna pop this mother trucker out there, bro. On camera. Uh oh. Yo, will we see like a ghost figure appear in the, the reflection? Oh my god, man. Bro, why is it not popping? Sadly, in 2016, Price's other daughter passed away. She couldn't help but think that this could be a gesture from her lost daughter making contact from the beyond. Mm. Price also notes that there were no fans, AC... But, okay, listen, if it's uh, her a daughter making a contact, 
then I think it wouldn't be demonic, right? It wouldn't be like she would be after uh, hurting her or hurting the family any in any way. Maybe it's just a way to say that, yeah, I'm doing good. I miss you guys, whatever. I mean, some of you will believe that, some of you won't, which is perfectly fine. I'm just trying to make sense of that. If that's real, you know what I mean? If that's real. I don't know if that's real or not, okay? I don't know, man. Your window's open at the time this was recorded, so it's hard to explain the balloon's oddly specific movement. Mm, very close to the ground Most on viewers top. viewers agree that the balloon seemed to float straight up to Price intentionally. Yeah. While it's hard to know what's happening here for certain, if this gesture brings some comfort to the family in what must be a very difficult yeah. time, then that's all that really matters. True. Yeah, if that's supposed to be real, or if that's supposed to be a gesture from the person, then I don't think it's demonic. It's just a way to say, yeah, guys, like, don't worry, I'm fine. Before we take a look at a creepy old property in Nevada that's reported to be heavily haunted, oh, remember to hit that uh -oh. subscribe button and tickle Make that sure to button. smash, hit the subscribe bell, and check out Slap Time as well, like on there and turn on all channel notifications. Yep, hit the bell, man. Be it's all about hitting the bell. Scary and mysterious videos. All about hitting the bell. We, be, we, be, we got, like, videos come in three, four times, sometimes five of times a week. comes from a paranormal investigation group known as Haunt Hunters. In this video, the team investigates the old Washoe Club in Virginia City, Nevada, a location many locals believe to be heavily haunted. The team starts by setting up their specialized equipment to try and get a read on the property. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready for this one though. Okay, so the wires are moving because he's the moving, Washoe I got Club spooked. The dates back to the late 19th century and was known on the Pacific Coast as a luxury destination for the elite. The club once housed one of the finest libraries in the United States, and its stately rooms were filled with Italian marble, bronze statues, and carved black walnut sideboards. Its guest list comprised of members of high society and military officials, like General Ulysses S. Grant, General Robert Sherman, and railroad magnate Darius Ogden Mills, among a list of- 50 Yo, my guy got monkey beard. I love the monkey beard, man. 50 other millionaires of international repute. However, over the years, things began to take a turn for the strange for this one's go-to. Dude, the, the old era look was so distinctive. You see, you look at this picture, you, you can tell like it's old, right? Crazy how time flies, right? How much change is happening in the world. Like in the next five, 10 years, it would like, just think about it from the 2000 to 2022 right now, things have progressed so fast. I remember back in 2010s, like, dog like early 2000s like people would use those flip-flop phones right in the last 10 years smartphones just completely blown up blown up what what's next what are we gonna get next right Pl we're moving fast to hot spot as millionaires drank their fill they mingled with prostitutes and shady characters who would come and go through two secret exits at the rear of the building there are rumors that one of the rooms of the parlor was used to house dead bodies while grave diggers waited for the ground to thaw during cold winters. Mm. Today, the property is said to be haunted by three notable spirits. First is the lady in blue, a blonde haired woman spotted at the top of the spiral staircase. Why does it always have to be a blonde haired lady, man? She said to linger for a second, then disappear without a trace. Why a blonde here? Some guests have spotted a scared uh -oh. little girl that faces the corner of one of the rooms crying. When they go to console her, they're confused to find nothing but a strange energy in the room and a cold e pocket of air. E Finally, there's the spirit of an old-timey prospector who's believed to have a penchant for whiskey. He's known <laughs> to knock over patrons' drinks when they aren't looking. Bartenders even leave out a single shot of bourbon overnight to appease his spirit. Damn. Back on the Haunt Hunters investigation, the team have set up an old doll in a chair and are trying to communicate with any spirits that might be present. I have a feeling it's gonna be bad, man. I, I, I feel like that- to communicate. Uh-oh. Just put all your strength into pushing one of these balls. They ask a series of questions. And eventually, this happens. It oh, oh my god! Oh. oh, the ball's moving. Thank you! Okay, so far so good. No way, that was amazing! I anybody anybody knows what's anybody knows what's this device name is it like motion detection device it would be going off whenever it would detect motion but 
Oh, oh wrong. My bad. My bad. It wasn't meant to fire that. But oh, <laughs> or is it another? I because if it's a motion device, the guy's also moving, right? I don't think it's that. It's something else. Help me on boys. You are so incredibly strong. Thank you. Can you do it again? Can you push this ball? I'll push it right back. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, it's moving. All right. That was incredible. Oh, gosh, Thank you so much. Go ahead and roll that again. Is Out it a frequency nowhere, device? A ball rolls across the floor, seemingly in response to one of their questions. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Thank you. I think it's a frequency device. No way. That was amazing. I Y'all thoughts chat like y'all think it's legit y'all think it's fake so far the videos we have seen they haven't been too crazy which Which is different from what we have seen with like bizarre bub uh, nukes top 5 and other ghost channels out there And it's perfectly fine. I feel like the slap time Videos to me they aren't too scary, but they're very compelling and, and the reason is, the reason I think these are more legit than the rest of the videos is because they are very like very tame in comparison They're not like over the top and sometimes stuff that is not over the top. It's actually can some can be legit You know, what I mean, it's not too crazy right compared to what the other the videos. team believes this could be the spirit of a young child attempting to communicate but just whether it's the little girl that's famous for haunting this property remains unknown. Mm. The Washoe Club has become such a notorious destination that Travel Channel's Ghost Adventures even filmed an entire episode here. For real? The club even runs regular guided ghost tours that cover all three floors of this historic property. Guests are encouraged to take photos and record audio because you never know what the next tantalizing piece of evidence might be. Oh, oh my I feel like this. Oh. Thank yeah. you. I feel like this and Skinwalker, but Skinwalker Ranch is definitely one of the most popular, I would say. But click on this video on the screen and I will see you right there. I'm telling you, this is probably the scariest video. Click on it and we'll see you there. Subscribe.